Hi guys, welcome to my channel. Today I shall be giving a review about the Blackstar ID Core 20 V2. This 20 watt solid state stereo combo takes the impressively full sound Blackstar are known for and adds smooth effects and voicings to the mix. These combinations make it one of the most versatile little amps available. Let's take a closer look and find out what makes this one of the best amps under $200. As hinted upon in the introduction, one of the highlights of the ID Core 20 V2 is the impressive selection of instant voicings and effects on offer, including 6M models such as Clean Warm, Clean Bright, Crunch, Super Crunch, OD1 and OD2, and dual strong modulation and delay effects. The amp design will be familiar to anybody who had experience with black star combos before, with clean aesthetics and all black case hiding a pair of 5 inch speakers that deliver 20 watts of power. On top of all the physical controls we mentioned below, this amp also incorporates digital functionality. Plugging into a computer via the amp's USB port allows you to create patches and new voices, as well as record the amp directly into the computer with the digital GUI. Purchasing the ID Core 20 V2 also gives you access to the PreSonus Studio One Digital Audio Workstation. This allows players to record, edit and mix new tracks online through their amp. Not a deal breaker, but a good condition if this is the route you are heading. Though these black stars offer a ton of tonal options, the controls are pretty simple. Headphone and MP3 jacks are located next to the input. After that, there's the voice knob where you can select which of the 6 amp models you like to play through. Standard gain and volume knobs come next. The EQ knob uses Blackstar's patented ISF known as infinite shape feature to control your tone. Turning the knob one way will control your sound more like traditional American amps while the other direction delivers a more British sound. After that lies the effects section. There are two total effects with four in each of the three categories, reverb, delay and modulation. Simply hit the corresponding button, then turn the dial to each of the four positions to access all the effects. For time dependent effects like delay and tremolo, the tap button below allows you to customize the rate. Tap the button twice and the time between taps will become the new effect time. It's not the easiest system to use on the fly, but it's intuitive enough. This is an amp clearly built for gain. The clean warm voice is solid with a good blend of smoothness and snappiness. But the clean bright model oscillates between chimmy and shrill with a tiny quality at times. The crunch sound are where this amp really performs. With the gain at low to medium levels, the crunch and super crunch voicings deliver delicious Hendrix style tones, perfect for overdrive and blues and classic rock. As you open up the gain dial, you move into harder rock territory. The OD voicings work well for hard rock with a drive below noon, but cross firmly into metal territory with more overdrive applied. The effect knob is also a pleasant surprise. The effect hold up well with natural sound, and the tap button works surprisingly smoothly. Overall, this isn't a loud amp, but likely too quiet to jam and certainly too quiet to gig with but the stereo sound gives it a wide open voice even at lower levels. The ID Core 20 V2 is great for players looking for a budget friendly yet versatile practice combo. The stereo speakers, voicings and dual FX allow for practically limitless customizations of your sound. The crunch voicings are superb for this price range and the effects are impressively high quality. The digital functionality here with the cherry on the top of a very sweet amp for the price. Thank you for watching the video, I hope you like it.